Hey everybody, this is Tammy from Cafe Worlds Addicts Anonymous. Um, also, I'm going to be posting this into uh, another uh, Cafe World group. Um, I know everybody's having problems with Hank, the mission with Hank. Uh, I used to do a, um, as you see, I'm a Vampire Diaries um, fanatic. Um, everybody's having problems with Handyman, Hank the Handyman. I know with XP, I used to run a program that had problems all the time. And what it is, is how I used to fix mine was go into my Windows folder. Inside the Windows folder, there's a prefetch folder. And what it is, if that folder, prefetch folder, quote, prefetch, is the folder that Microsoft legally spies on us. Every time that you boot your computer up, every time that you go to a website, every time that you even play a game that's on your computer, say the game's over here, it tells them what time, how long, how long you've been on Google, how long you've been even running this computer, you'll see it when I show you. And the only people that can read them is people at Microsoft. This just gives them statistics, statistics and everything. That's why they legally can do it. So if you're on XP, this is how you do it. If not, it's really easy to do. You just find, you go to my computer or you can find your local disk, which is usually your C drive. And in C drive, you open your Windows folder. Inside of Windows folders, you open up the pre-fetch. P-R-E-F-E-T-C-H. And delete the contents of pre-fetch. You'll be amazed. I just deleted mine yesterday, but let's see how much I got. I'm going to go to my computer. Of course, you get a start and you go all, go to my computer. Open my local disk. Let me just bring this up. Go into my Windows folder. Sometimes it may say these files are hidden. Unfi unhide those. See right here? Prefetch. Double click it. See? Chrome, Google. There's all. See, I don't even know what these are. There's Notepad, MP3 Rocket, which I download my music. There's Java. Um, as you hear, my new puppy in the background. Here's software, there's setup, Y Super, which is the thing I used to go in Yahoo. And only people, you know, like there's layout, there might sometimes might be a folder in there and it still can be deleted. And what happens when you run a program for so long, even if you clear out your Adobe Flash player, that helps. But if there's a, a corrupt file in the program or drink game that you are running, then the best thing for you to do is to go ahead and delete the pre the contents of your prefetch folder. So I always go to edit and select all and then I go to file and go to delete. There's others. See and I just deleted these yesterday and there's 116. So basically that's what I'm trying to say. It helps out a lot. You know you can go to um, the the uh, Adobe Flash player which I have that bookmarked I believe. I hope. Yep right there it is. And you can go there and delete all sites. Confirm. Easy as peasy. I will go ahead and put the links up for that. And like I said, if you're not on XP, basically you need to find your main hard drive, your local disk, C drive. And once you open that up, you go to Windows folder. Make sure that you get open Windows folder open and then go ahead and go to your prefetch. Open that up and delete all contents. I assure you, I had a friend that worked for Microsoft. He's, I haven't talked to him for a year or two. But this is the legal way that Microsoft does spy on us. And if there is a corrupt file in your computer or any, pro, uh, any kind of game, I used to run uh, Red Light Center, uh, youthverse.com, and there was corruptness all the time. So I used to always have to go ahead and clear that out every day. But anyway, I hope this helps out. If not, get a hold of me. Um, you can get a hold of me in the group or anywhere else. Team Louise Johnson. Talk to you all later. Bye.